Hey everyone, welcome to Mix It Up Art. Today we are going to be making these negative leaves using chalk pastels and some real leaves. To get started, you're going to get a sheet of white construction paper as well as a leaf or two. You will also need a paper towel and some chalk pastels. You are going to start with one leaf and you want to make sure that you lay it down flat on the paper and you are going to use one finger and you're basically gonna rub your finger onto the chalk to make your finger dirty. And then you're gonna start on the inside of the leaf and you're going to just drag the color out. So I need to go back and, and get color every couple swipes, but I'm starting from the leaf and then dragging outward. Now you can choose to use all one color for a leaf or you can use a whole bunch of different colors. For most of my leaves, I use different colors every inch or so. It's really important that you keep the leaf in place and this can be tricky because the leaf in itself is wavy and bumpy and kind of wants to move around unlike a stencil. So you just really want to be careful that you are making sure the leaf does not move anywhere while you're adding the chalk pastel. As you will see, I am going to be moving my stabilizing hand in all different directions so that I can keep the leaf in place. You want to make sure that you put the chalk pastel all the way around the leaf before removing it and that honestly just makes it easier than trying to like line it back up with the part that you already did. If you hold it in place it just makes it a lot easier. And then once you're done adding in all of your chalk when you remove the leaf you will have a beautiful outline. And then all you're going to do is just continue this process. So I'm using both a maple leaf and an oak leaf and I'm just going to place them wherever I feel like I want to put them on the paper. Um, I'm trying to keep them close together. I did do a couple that overlapped, but it's totally up to you how you want to design your pictures. So feel free to place them in any direction that you want. You can place them in the middle, off to the side, you can do half a leaf. You'll see a combination of all of this in my picture. You just want to make sure to use your entire paper so the only negative space you should have on there is the leaves and that just makes them really stand out and look awesome. And that is really all there is to it. I hope you guys make these, and if you do, don't forget to tweet me a picture at MixItUpArt. Have fun!